Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Okay, this is the same day, I just took a little break. Um, hopefully you guys are doing wonderful. We're gonna be continuing with the pile. This one would probably be number five, I think. Video number five, okay. Um, if you hear any noises in the background, I'm just watching YouTube and uh, you know, I love watching my lives. So yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Okay, so we're gonna go through the next uh, pile. It's gold looking items. So I'm just gonna pull out some stuff. If you guys are interested in anything and you see something that you are, would like to purchase, please don't hesitate to email me. Just give me the information that you need. Actually, you know what? I should probably start putting a little, uh, making a little note for y'all so you guys can have an idea of where to reach me and then what kind of information I need. So, because this, everything is for sale. I'm selling everything. So don't hesitate. If you do see something you like, um, yeah, let me know. I'll do my little research, but you can get, you will get a good deal. Don't worry, you will get a good deal. So yeah, if you're interested. I do have, the only person I have here right now is my husband. He's just in the background. He's gonna be doing, going in and out and stuff like that. But yeah, just wanted to let you guys know. Yeah, there's some beautiful necklaces here. No idea if they're gold. Um, but we will do the magnet test. And then we will check to see if there's anything that... Um, I'll put this one aside for now. That one's really long. Okay. I'll grab a couple more. Look at this one's really delicate and dainty. I don't know what it is, but... We will see. Kind of looks like an ink clip, but then it looks, I don't know. We will find out. Here's a bracelet with some elephants. Uh, there's a necklace. I'm just grabbing. I'm not uh, particularly picking anything. Just grabbing, guys. Just grabbing. I did take a picture of it so you guys can see. Um, here is... I don't think I have room for that, actually. Oh, okay. I think... Hmm. I don't have another bracelet here. I would put another bracelet right there. Okay, here, I have something silver. Here we go. There, that should be good enough, right? We'll take a little picture here. So you guys can see. Not everything is on here. I'll back it up a little bit. Okay, let's do the magnet test, and then we will see which one is... If there's gold or silver okay there this one got lifted this one is good and look at the clasp too okay that one it's good this one here I will still show the pieces that are attaching, so don't you worry. Okay, so those are the pieces that are not going by the magnet. Don't know if they're gold or if they're what they are, but uh, the magnet is not working. We will do another test on them again, just to make sure that those are the ones that are not sticking to the magnet. Okay, so that looks good. Okay, let's go through the stuff that's sticking with the magnet. If you are interested in anything, I'll have my information down below. Please take a peek. I have an eBay, a Poshmark store. I have lots of unique items, purses, um, shoes, boots, clothing, little knickknacks. Okay, here is a necklace. It's a really dainty small necklace, and it has a... Uh, a I'm gonna bring it closer, guys. Sorry about that. Painted enamel, 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 enamel. And this feels like a real pearl, but I don't know if this is anything in here. Maybe this is not real chain, but maybe this is. It is really pretty though. It's very dainty. Look at the way that um, the way that the the gold is moving onto the flower. It's very, very pretty. 
you know, but I don't see anything here yet. Can't see it by from the eye, okay? So I'll put that out along the side for now. Okay, and then we have this one here. This looks like it's um, Jesus and is that would be Mary? Mary, I guess. Sorry, I'm, I, I'm not too sure. This is the piece here. That's the necklace and that's the clasp. Okay. I'm going to be putting a bunch of religious stuff together so at least I have it all together so I don't have to um, yeah I don't want to separate it okay look at this piece here this is a really lovely piece um, that, it did have an old barrel clasp it looked like this is the pendant and it is see-through gems like that with a little pearl at the end um, very slippery and I would assume this is a full pearl because it's not even shaped as a real pearl I'm assuming they're not like that I can't read to see if the tag is there's an extra tag there but kind of reminds me like of an Avon and it's really dainty this one here is just like a rose gold kind of tarnished looking uh, bracelet here is the other necklace here that's what the piece looks like this could be something but I'm not too sure I don't know okay that looks like nothing much but it is a short one okay so I'm gonna just put these ones aside okay, okay. now these ones here where the magnet was not um, lifting them so but I don't know if they are gold or what they're made out of here is a necklace and it does have an extension on it and I don't see anything here so not sure what it is I don't think I see anything there I don't see it but okay that's that one there uh, the length is probably about I would say a 15 it may measures an 8 or 16 but I'll be safe to say a 15 so it's a nice little dainty necklace and I love the way it's sitting like the uh, crosses it's really pretty I love that because that's really that looks tough to do okay the next necklace is this one here um, doesn't have anything that I could see on the clasp so far. This is the pendant and there looks like a diamond we will put on the machine to see. This one doesn't have anything on it, but we will test it. It doesn't look like a diamond to me. It looks like a rhinestone. looks like it's just because it doesn't even have anything protecting it if it was a diamond again it is a short necklace we have a chain necklace here that's what the clasp looks like I don't think this is real there is the length there is something on the end it's like a a gem looking rhinestone oh, I don't know who made it but it's, like I said, it's not sticking, so you never know, right? So don't want to be throwing things away that's actually solid gold, right? But it doesn't say anything on it, so that's why. This one's measuring an 8, and then with it, the 8, so it's 16, I would say it's an 18 in length. And we're going to test this diamond right now. The machine is working. There it is here. Let's see if I could get it over closer to you. I'm hoping that this will be the last uh, video for the tray. I'm not too sure what's underneath the napkin, so let's check it out. Yeah, I didn't think it was going to be anything because it's not even holding. Yeah, it's not even holding, so yeah. I don't think it's anything. And the chain is... Like I said, it's the older first one of the, it looks like one of the first, um, 
into how they make them. One of the first. Okay. Here's the next one here. It's a nice, just um, different kind of chain. Again, it's short, huge lobster claw clasp. Clousers. Very light. Here, this one here. This is delicately made. That's beautiful. Beautiful there. The stars are delicate. Here is a lobster clasp. It doesn't even look like it belongs. It's like kind of silver in a way. But this is pretty. Then dainty, 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 dainty. And I don't know if it has anything on it. Here is the next necklace, a bracelet, and it has a bunch of little looking rhinestones or gems in there. What does it say? Does it tag, hang tag on there? And it says, V, Viva, Viva Anne, Viva Anne, Viva Anne, I'll pronounce it. I mean, sorry, I'll spell it. V-I-V-I-A-N-A, -A, second word, oh, initials D, and then second word, third word, or I call it second word, I don't know, is, or it's actually D, D, and then, what is that? O-N-T-A, And oh, I don't know if it's Italian. I'm not too sure. The way it's sounding. The way it's sounding. Could be Italy gold. It's really dainty. Okay, and then we have this, but we will check the diamond or the gems. Look at this, guys. This is really cool. It has the silver, the bronze, and the gold. And then it has this thick clasp right here with this piece right here. This is this clasp here, it looks like it's something big. These little elephants look like they're unique. This is a really nice um, bracelet. I'm not sure if it's real, guys. It doesn't say anything on it that I could see. Um, but the way it looks, it looks like it is um, gold, bronze, silver. Yeah, the way, the way it looks to me, it looks like it's real. Yeah, so I'll put this over here. And then this here, we're gonna check these out. Let's see. These ones are not testing, they're like sticking, not sticking, so I'm gonna just put them on the side here for now. I don't think, I don't know. I, I just, I'm scared that it's gold and then you throw it away kind of thing, uh, you know. If you guys can give me um, give me options or tell me what I should do, that would be great. What do you guys think I should do? Is there a way that gold does not stick? I know that, I mean, if it doesn't stick, that doesn't mean that it's not gold or it is gold or it could be something else. Give me, can you give me an idea, guys, please and thank you. Okay, just testing, nothing. But we will, I'm gonna, te I'm gonna look up the name, definitely. And I want to see. Maybe this person makes gold. I don't know. But it is nothing right now. I will do my research. Let's go and let's continue doing the show and tell. Let me turn my machine off. Okay, so uh, I want to get make sure I get this going because I don't want to be talking. I talk too much, guys. You know that. Okay, so we have this rosary here. This looks like it's gold to me. This is the rosary that I think it is. And here we have this piece here. Old um, C clasp it has on it. It's really cool, nice locket necklace here. It's really pretty, very pretty actually. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get everything in or done. There might be another one. There might be another one.
no there will be another more definitely another one but i don't know there might be in part six i mean i guess i should say there might be a part six and then i have a lot of little knickknacks and stuff like that um like little earrings and stuff like that around here too so i gotta get those too okay paper towel gone paper towel gone Yay. we're getting closer to the end whoa look at this one this is fancy i didn't think i could stick it on there sorry guys I think that's pretty much it. I'm not gonna, there's no more necklaces that I can see here. It's just a bunch of little pieces of jewelry. Okay, so, uh, you know what? Let me throw this one on actually, just because it is, um, it is, you know, I'll put this here. It is uh, the last part of the last, one of the last necklaces that I can see from here. I don't know what's on the other part there, but yeah, I just wanna let you guys know that. And look at the different colors of golds. I'm going to bring it out a little bit so I can, you guys can see what I'm collecting on this side. But that's okay. I want to show you guys everything. Okay, nice and close now. And we are going to do our little magnet test. Magnet test. Okay, we got the magnet out. We'll do the magnet test. I'll start here. I got to be careful again. Oh, boy. Okay, it's getting stopped by, okay, with this one here. It's collecting it, so I'm just gonna take this. I don't wanna ruin the necklace, guys. I don't like using a magnet very hard on these things because I feel it's ripping the gold off. Okay, this one. Oh, this one's sticking. Interesting. I thought maybe this might be, unless this is a different one. I'll just put this aside for now. Oh, there you go, this one too. But doesn't mean that's not worth any. Just because it's not gold doesn't mean that it's worth anything or not worth anything, right? Because it could be back in the day. I don't want to break it. God, I don't like that. Hi, Lola. I'll take my last sip here. Look at a little baby outside. This one has a little, just a little. Presentation. Just imagine if that was all gold. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That would be remarkable. Okay. This one here is not sticking. This one here is sticking. And then one more. And that has hesitation. Okay. So the only one that's not is this one here. That's not testing as, or not sticking. This one here. And it does have a tag. It has like a a triangle, sorry. And then it has a huge lobster claw on there, okay? I don't know whose signature that is. And there is some wear on there. Kind of looks like it's almost like a copper in a way. It could be a copper. Does it have a name in the back? Oh, it does have a name. Nice. We will Google it. I mean, we will look at the name. Thank you, my love. You okay? Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah, I'm just going to trade it. Yeah? You are going to do it then? You talk to Joel and ask him about it? He doesn't think it is? No. Okay, so this one says 1976. Liz. Liz Claiborne. 1976. That's all it says on there. So I'm not too sure. It's a really nice chain. Very nice. And it looks like it's pretty old the way it's looking. Let's see. It is an 18, so it's a 16 inch plus two inches. So it's an 18 inch ish. Okay, so I'm gonna put that on the side because it wasn't sticking. Okay, and I will just lay the other jewelry out so we can do our little investigation. Right. Okay, you got an office too. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Okay, good, good. Okay, well, good luck with your trade, baby. Thank you. Yeah. Did you take anything out for dinner? Yeah. Okay, well, it's I don't know about that then. Okay, sorry. 
my husband. I keep on telling him to bring something out for dinner and he doesn't, not listening. So if he doesn't listen, he doesn't get food, right? It's going to end up getting takeout. Okay. So that's what the clasp looks like. And it's crazy. This is like almost like, is it one of those ones? Or no? Hang on. I'm not sure what this is. I've never seen something like this before. So it does move. Oh, it's like a sizer. So you can make it tighter. Oh, look at that. It just popped right off. Interesting. That's different. That is definitely different. Huh. It's almost like an earring the way it's going, but it's not. That's unique. Nothing like this before. But the way the pin looks. Like it ha oh wait, it has something on the pin. I don't know if that's the earring pin. Oh no. Uh, okay, there we go. It's slippery. I will look. Yeah, you know what? That is different. That looks like a earring pin. Weird. Okay, so that's that. Sorry, it's taking me a while to oh, to go through it. I'm sorry. That was a yellow gold. Okay, look at this rosary. It's really delicate, pretty. And I really, it's dainty. It's very, 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 um, yeah, dainty. Super dainty. That's that one there. Really pretty. I should take a picture. I don't think I took very many pictures, eh? I don't think so. Whoa. Hello. I gotta be able to learn how to do this so when I start, hopefully when I start, I can take some pictures here and get this nice and beautiful. The sun is gone. Okay. There we go. Too much playing again. I'm so sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, I'm putting that away. Okay, here are the next one. It's this clasp here. So if you want, you could take the watch off. Man, that must have been a tight take off, put on and take off. But whoa, look at that. Goes halfway. I don't even know what this is. If it's a watch or a locket, look at the way it looks. I like the way it looks. We don't know how old it is, but it's really pretty. Let's move it nice and a little closer. Um, oh yes, yeah, this is how you open it, right? You use the pin, pop. There we go. It is a watch. A watch, it does have a name in it. It's a pocket watch, Roman numerals. No glass, it doesn't look like there's a glass or anything on it. So the protection would be this piece here. The name, I will spell it to you. It is S-H-E-F-F-R-A-L-D. I think that's what it is. I think that's what it is. Hmm, interesting. Don't know who that is, but it's a really pretty pocket watch. I'm not sure how old it is. Look at the way it looks. Very dainty. Nice, beautiful woman's watch. Don't know when it was made, but it is a stunning watch. Necklace, and there is the clasp. And even these pieces are nice, but it is not gold. But it doesn't mean that it's not worth anything. I think that this could be really old itself, but we will do its Google search and we will find out. Okay, let's pick this one up. This one I liked, I was really intrigued by this. This one here, it looks like a bunch of flowers. It's really, really pretty and dainty looking too. I know I keep on saying dainty, but this, like, look at the way this is made. This is the clasp here. It goes all the way to the back part and there is a tag and that's what it looks like. Let's read what it says. It says, oh, 
don't know what this says. I don't know if this says Trafari. T R I. Whoa, that is hard. Okay, let's look again, guys. T R. Yeah, it's Trafari. T R I F I A R I, and then T M. Yeah, Trafari. It says Trafari. So I'm not sure if Trafari makes gold. But it is a very long necklace and it's gorgeous. Okay. Here's this next one here. It's a has a star with a little diamond. And this is the little tiny clasp. Very tiny, little, little. And there's a little rhinestone at the end this kind of looks like a sororsky crystal oh actually the diamond i mean the star goes to the bottom so it's a part of something let's see what it is let's see what this is i gotta look it doesn't want to go flat on for me okay so it has the moon with diamonds in it not sure what kind of if it's real or if it's fake and then it has this piece here this flat piece and then it has the star this is a really cute one and then it has this piece here it could be quartz or plastic and then this one here it's like a cloud this is a cute little necklace and it's made really well it's like a little charm necklace and it's really thin hmm i wonder if this is something it did it did stick right yeah, it did stick, but we will test these diamonds if I can test them. Let's put the tester back on. Is it okay if I put a tester back on and on like that, off and on? Mm -hmm. That is hot. My husband just made another pot of coffee. Okay, we will wait until the machine warms up. Look at this beautiful necklace. Rhinestone necklace with this huge diamond. Hmm. And this one here is the lobster clasp, long extension to it. And look at the way the back is made in case you guys wanna see what the back looks like. And that is a huge diamond, guys. I'm not sure. I think it's plastic, but it's huge. Okay, and the last one from this one is this medallion has all those little pebble of, actually three, and then these other ones around. And then it has these pearls, these 10 looking pearls with, what do they have? They have little um, plastic ones in the, mid, in the in between them. And then the gold chain, they're actually um, going smaller, so bigger to smaller, graduated, and then there's the chain. It's in excellent condition. Here it is, the clasp, and you got the extra extension with the pearl at the end. So this is made very well, and we're gonna, I noticed there was a trademark in the back, so we will look to see. And it says G R A Z I A N O. I'll have to Google that. I don't know who that is, but uh, it's a really pretty necklace. Very, very pretty necklace. Yeah, I like that. It's very, um, very, it's very simple, but dainty too. Sorry, I know like, I got that word stuck right in my head. And the measurement for it, in case you guys want to know, is 16 plus an extra three, so 19. 
19 inches, around 19 inches. Okay, now let's test these little diamond things here. And then we're gonna go to the earrings. It looks like a bunch of earrings. Okay. Let's check. Let's check this one first. I'm gonna check the back because I don't like poking the, the the thing in the front in case it's okay. Sorry. Nothing. Okay. We will just check to see if it's glass. Okay, so it's nothing. Thought maybe if it was Swarovski crystal because of the way that it's. Why is that popping up as glass? No, I'll Google search it and then we will see. Okay, let's try out. Um, we will try out the uh, this one here. Let's see if it's glass. Wow. What do you guys think? It's glass. That's a big piece of glass there, girls and boys. I don't know if I can get through this. Yeah, exactly. It's like, uh, beat it, lady. Well, let's do this one again. Ah, see, I don't like that because see, it just slide like that. And I always so fearful that it's gonna, it's gonna scratch it. I don't know why, but I do. So there, this is uh, glass. So this is a crystal necklace. trying out these little guys no I don't want metal so the big one is these ones I'm having a hard time it doesn't look like they're probably there's so many of them wow that's gorgeous guys I'm gonna take a picture of that okay Let's grab the other stuff. That's pretty cool. I'll put this one aside. I put that with my rhinestone stuff. Okay, so we're just gonna grab the earrings down and I will just place them. I'll open this up a little bit so you guys can see the mat. There it is. I have lots of stuff around me, guys. You guys wouldn't even know how much stuff I have. Then I have some, I'm just going to throw out the earrings. I would just throw, put the earrings out. Just, I don't know if they have pears, anything like that. I'm just going to grab what I have in front of me. And that's pretty much it. Okay. I'm going to put them in their little piles. I'm just pretty much grabbing whatever I see. Lots of odds and ends. So I'm not sure if there are odds and ends. I'm not too sure. I'm just grabbing I'm assuming those are the odds and ends because they're on the side there, I guess. Okay, I'm done with the cotton, I think. Oh, wait, there's one more here okay done with the paper towel yay paper towel gone all done okay. and then 
We have another paper towel we can get rid of here. And then under that was um, this stuff here. Bubble wrap. Okay. And then I have some necklaces and some baggies. And then I have a couple watches and some necklaces here. This will be empty. Just bringing things closer to me so I can just grab. There we go. So we'll have one more after this and then we're done. I'm not gonna keep on looking. Actually, we'll probably have two more to be. We might have two more. Okay. Here it is. Let's take a picture of this gorgeousness. Okay. If you hear it, it's my puppy upstairs. She's just trying to tell the other kids that she wants to go out. <laughs> okay. So here are some earrings. They look like they are diamonds, like the little diamond that they, you know, the little minuscule diamonds. Um, look at the way the back is looks I don't know if it's gold I think these are real and I don't know how much they usually go for but I think those are real then we have these little guys here look at the way they look super cute I don't know if there's a maker's mark but they kind of look like watches okay I'm scared to do the I'm scared to do the testing on here because there's so much stuff. Oh here, look at what is this? This is a bracelet. A guess bracelet. Didn't even know I had it here. It's like a a copper looking one. And then it has this flower. Yeah, flower. It's really delicately made, guys. So that's that. Don't know, uh, but the clasp the clasp book's broken. Here we got some owls, clip-ons, clip-ons. You know it's crazy because they're making clip-ons. Well, they've been making clip-ons, but they've been making clip-ons for so long that they still make them, and you could buy them at Claire's. But here's two little owls, two little owls. Just taking a little picture. I don't know if they're diamonds. Don't think that they will be, but. And there's no maker's mark. And I'm just putting the stuff that I look at on that side there so we don't um, mix up. Here is another owl and it has discolored um, pieces, rhinestones. The eyes, this could be gold, I don't know. It's a pendant for a necklace. It looks old. No maker's mark that I could see. So put it over there. Have these earrings here. Look how delicate these ones are. They're like dangles. Oh wow, those are pretty. They're made nicely. Look at the way they're made. They're like feathered. Wow. Those are gorgeous. Like they look like baskets, weaving baskets. Wow, those are pretty. Mm -hmm. I gotta take a picture. Don't know if they're gold. Okay, that's not gold. Like this feels. No, so it's just metal. But they are really pretty. They're sellable for sure. They're gorgeous. And that one is. I'll use my magnet now that I have it out. So they're holding up these pieces here, I guess, because those are like aluminum. Okay. Let's just drop that for a second. And I'm, yeah, I'm just going to go through this. This just looks like a washer. Doesn't look like anything. There's this piece here. Looks like it's a shell from my earring. Or, yeah, a shell. 
Oh yeah, we did that one. Here is an earring, missing a pearl. Kind of looks like an Avon piece. We got the back like that. I don't know if there's a pair. And we did these ones already. These could be gold. But I'm gonna check those out. Um, what do we have here? These ones here. Blue crystal looking things, iridescent. Look at the color of them. Those are nice and dainty. I'll put them over there. They look syllable. Look at this one here. I'm not sure if I have its pair or partner, but it looks like a crystal. But I think it is fake crystal. I don't think it's real. Look at these ones here. They shine really pretty. Uh, I was when I was uh, picking them up, I could see the shine there, like almost like a like a marble but a shiny these must be they're almost like the same they're like the same um the way they're made even those ones there too hmm cute i don't know we kind of feel like plastic i'm not too sure okay we did show this leaf before i don't know if i have its partner if this is a separate one but I'll put it there we have this one here has a bunch of rhinestones on it uh, looks like it's just a heavy piece of metal and it looks like the colors are all placed different so look at this uh, bracelet here it does have some writing on it It says 925 Italy on it, 925 Italy. Okay, so, and it's like one of those chain um, charm bracelets. That's cool, fine. I'm putting that over here. Super pretty. These earrings, again, they look like the same maker, the way they're made with the wire. And these are real pearls. I think these are real pearls. They're all different shapes and sizes, and they're all different colors. And look at the way they are. And look at the way the, um, the blue shines. Like the sun is kind of out right now, but that blue, it shines really nice. Those are really cute. I'm gonna put them aside too. I think those are savable. I don't like to, um, I, one thing I, I, I think I'm gonna do is not sell too many earrings unless they don't look like they're worn or they're very in very good condition, you know? Yeah. That's just how I feel. But look at beautiful these are. These are nice, beautiful dangles. They're shiny if you wear them and they kind of highlight through your hair. Stunning pieces, I think. And then workmanship. Like they look like chandeliers. Those are pretty. Remember, everything is for sale. So if you're interested, please don't hesitate to ask. Because once it's gone, it's gone. I'm not going to be keeping anything. Okay, so I probably kept these earrings. I don't think I have a pair right here that I can see so far of them. But I think maybe if I kept them, um, they might be gold or they might be silver. This one says, what does it say? B, 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 C. And no idea what that is, no idea. But they, I kept them for a reason, so yeah. But I will do some more investigation. They look like silver and then they look like gold too. So I'll put these aside. We have this one here, has these little stones in there. Very tiny. And then we have these ones here. They have like a, it's like a dice or something, or just a sevens. Sevens. They did stick to the magnet, but I think these are syllable. They don't even look like they're worn and they're really gold, like the gold tone on them. Okay. I don't know what this one, this one says name on it. This looks like silver to me. It has a name on it, the back. Doesn't look like I have a partner for it so far. Look at these earrings here. 
These are clip-ons. I wonder if these are diamonds. These are rhinestone diamonds. They look like they're vintage. Yeah, they look old, guys. They look really, really, they look old. Okay, we will test that. We will test this one. There's the partner for this one. Here's some mushrooms. These ones look like they're worn. These ones here, they're really, uh, there is something on there. They're really shiny, they're really yellow. So this could be gold. Look at these guys. Wow, they're huge. Roses. They're really, really pretty. How they're made. Yeah, that's that. Super cute. Um, then we got these ones here with like the cat looking eye. These are really made really well. Holy man, look at they, the way they're made. Looks like silver. Look at Starburst. Those are pretty with a peach stone in there. Dainty. Okay, and then we have these charms. One says 925. I think maybe it says something on there. It has like a heart. And then, yeah. This one here is really tiny. It is a charm too. I'm not sure what bracelets it would be for. And I don't know if it says 925 on there. I think this might be like Pandora, right? They have little dainty ones. Look at these guys. These could be diamonds, right? With Mother of Pearl. We'll test those. Okay, and these were sticking. And then we have these clip-ons, pearls. Go, um, sorry, they're um, silver with the way the pearl is. It's... They are rough, they're not soft. Mm -hmm. What's those there? Yeah, I think those are pearls. We have this. We will test it. Let's check the tester on. We have this one, it says 925 on it. Don't know what it is. It looks like it's just a piece. Is it? Oh, so it's just a piece of silver, I guess. Maybe my honey tested it. That's why you put 925 or it says 925 on it. No idea, guys. Yeah, I don't want this video. We're already at 48 minutes of my life. It's so big, so long already. These ones here, they have this pink um rhinestones look at the way the back is made those are cool they're really really cool made made and with shine on them they're all tangled no idea where they're from doesn't have a maker's mark but it does have a little barcode on it so it's really yellow gold and they're made really well so that's cool okay so i put the machine on we're gonna test out a couple of these items here And then we will bring out the next stuff, I guess. Actually, you know what? We'll test them in a little bit. Um, you know what? Let's test them now. I don't, I have to, everything is all crammed up over here and pushed over to the sides, guys. It's crazy. Yes, it's a very, 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 very crazy here. Okay, let's test these things here. Let's test this. Okay, there it is. This just looks like glass, but it could be nothing. I want to test it on top here. I know it's not. It's just the position this is in. Okay, so it's nothing. Is it anything? Did it move? It doesn't feel like anything, I guess, but it looks pretty. Let's test these. What if we can? 
No. I'd like to test more than one because you never know one could have uh, been replaced with a fake one, right? Okay, well, these look vintage, though. Like the way they're made. They look like a wedding ring, like the side. Okay, this is the second earring. I guess it's nothing. Yeah. It's getting late now. I have to um, finish up this because it's getting late and I gotta cook or I gotta get dinner made. Okay, so this is nothing, but they are very pretty. I'm gonna put them with my rhinestone collection. Let's test these. Nothing. That one's nothing. It did look like it was something, though, eh? But it is a mother of pearl or something like that, the way it looks shell. And my daughter will be home soon. And she's hungry, she said, so. There, let's trust this one. Nothing. They're cool looking though. What the heck? That one tested. Interesting. I test one side. I test the back first because I didn't want to scratch the front. So we'll do it again. And I test the front. Hmm. It is testing this glass. That's that. Okay, let's go for the next items because this movie is gonna be a long time. It's gonna be like an hour, guys. Okay, I'm gonna just finish off this pile and then I wanna start putting everything together. Okay, so we have this, we have that, we have this, this we have. Bringing everything out now, guys. I don't want to I make this video as long as possible. I've already made it long enough. So I'm bringing everything out that I see. Oh, let me bring that out too, guys. Eh? So you guys can see that too. I have the earrings here. A bunch of watches here. This necklace. This necklace here I did price. And it did come with uh, some... Um, earrings, earrings I have with it, if I can find the other one, I don't know where it is. We do have a pair for these, a pair for that one, and we have another necklace here. So these are just all the bottom stuff, all the super odds and ends of stuff. And then I have the second earring for this one here. I'll show you that. And then this with a ring on it. Okay. And then just a bunch of odds and ends of earrings. And I think I kind of showed you guys a little bit of those. It doesn't look like I have um, pairs to them. Okay, and then it's empty. Yay, we went through it. Right on. Yay. This is the same earring here. Okay, we have one more pair. That's all done. It's empty. Holy moly. It's empty. Yes. Saranara. Man, I love when that stuff's done like that. Oh, I still have these necklaces here. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, and these bags. Okay, so I don't know where the other oh I don't know where the other earring is for this, but I did price it as eight dollars. I don't think it's really anything too spectacular, I guess. You could say that's probably why. But it is a beautiful necklace. It's just um it's comes with a pair of earrings, like I said. Um has some wear to it. Oh, I should take a picture, right? I should take a picture first so you guys can see. Let me just take a quick picture. So at least I have a picture. 
because I gotta make sure. Okay, so that's that. Here, there's this like a, a ring. It's like um one of those, um, it's like Teflon, but not Teflon. It's, what is that called? There's a word for it. It's a small one. It's a nice one though. It comes with this chain. I'm not sure if it's sterling. Don't know, not sure, but that's that. Look at this vintage necklace, super old and nice clasp here, vintage clasp, old. Okay, this one here, these are just fake and there's a little tag on there. These feel like plastic. GHR, GHR, no idea what it is. And it's like a anklet. I can't see that being a necklace, but it looks like an anklet, maybe, maybe. Look at this one here. This looks like amber, but not amber, but I don't know, amber? It's like a flower, it needs some cleaning. And then you have these little beads at the end right here. Tangled, I think, maybe. I don't know if it is. That's the marks on the end. Maybe it's a prey bracelet or something. I'm not too sure. Or a necklace. Comes with this little daisy. I'll have to Google it. Not sure what it is, guys. I'm so sorry. But if you guys have an idea what it is, let me know in the comment section. Please and thank you. Okay. Then we got this Tree of Life watch. Does not look used to me. Could be, maybe. The back looks good. Uh, I think it's a watch. Let's see, can we open it? Oh, it's on this side. Oh, it's not. Oh, it's one of those little things that you put on your wrists. Interesting. See, so like the little charms? Interesting. So if you're interested in that, let me know. Then I got this watch here. It's broken. It's a Spider-Man, not Spider-Man, sorry, Superman. It goes into that. That's what the back looks like. It looks new. Retail for $20. Superman. Needs a new battery. I'll put everything with the watches. This one here. Mm, doesn't look too used. And it's called V E L L A C I O. Japan. And there it is here. It's a nice peach coral color with it looks like mother of pearl and the name right there with this it's made really well i got this um bracelet here not sure what it is who made it if it's from or if it's just made from china i'm not too sure kind of does look like it is because i do like coffee cats eh? I never know what that is, but it, it is pretty. It is pretty. It doesn't have any mark on it, so I'm not too sure. Then we have these earrings that I showed last time. They do have writing right there. I'm not too sure. They look like they are something. Oh, this one is separate by itself. These ones are shell. Shell. And there's a little tag on the back of that one. This one could be gold. It's like a pendant. I'm gonna put this with a pendant. I think this is like a pendant. Yeah, I'll put that with the pendant. I think that's a pendant. Then we have these earrings they are like clustered diamonds. It could be gold. That could be gold. These ones here. Wow, they're really shiny. They have these little hang tags on them. Not sure, didn't say anything on them. I didn't do the magnet test on them either, so I'm not too sure. And then we have these ones. These are beautiful, heavy duty. Wow, look at the back of them. The machine is on, so we will test these. These are really pretty. They look like butterflies in a way. Okay, so I'll test these. And then we got this big, big, big one here. No name in the back. Not sure if there's something right there. Then we did see this one, no pair for that. That's definitely probably silver. And then we got these ones here. 
Look at the way these ones are. They turn different colors. I don't know what kind of stones they are or if they're stones, but they turn blue to purple. Pretty cool. The back is right here. But they are cool. Okay, and that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry it's going to be a little bit of an hour long. I'm going to save these necklaces and bracelets for the other haul um, that I have. Uh, just because they've already been packed and stuff. But everything else is done. We finished. Relief. We finished the tray. We finished the pile, guys. Yay! Six hours later. At least six hours of work. And I still have to do more work on it. So lots of stuff. I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for being patient and watching my channel. Hopefully you guys can buy something if you see something. I do have an eBay and a Poshmark account. I love you guys. You guys all stay safe. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Okay, I'll see you guys. You guys all take care. Time to cook dinner. Take care. Bye-bye all. Mm, sorry, I'm back. Just a quick little test. I just tested them to see what they were and they came out to be glass okay or crystal so i just wanted to let you know so this could be gold in here we will do more investigation but these are stunning they're still on the card and they are fantastic beautiful these ones i might have a hard time testing the diamonds because they're so close together going to glass but I'm not too sure if that's just I'm hoping that's not the metal touching could be but yeah I think see that's the that's the, the, the not the good thing is that these things are so small like this you don't even know what you got yeah see it's 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 going up quick There's nothing that I could see. And I think that's pretty much it. Okay. And I don't think this is it. I don't think this stuff gets tested. I don't even know what it is. But, okay. Thank you guys. See you. Bye.